the hair. Obviously, it's become your signature. And you and I were just talking off camera. We know we know each other a long time, and the hair has always been there. What's the maintenance that's required on that thing? This this thing is actually the hair erection is actually relatively it's actually relatively <laughs> easy to maintain. It's one of my only gifts is that it just kind of it just kind of stands. I don't really know why. Although I'm thinking about switching it because. This Fashion Week, Tom Brown, designer Tom Brown, had a show. They ran an article about it in Vogue about how all the models had hair erections. They mentioned me. <laughs> and now I'm seeing people with it. I think it's like a thing, which means my work here is done. And then I need to move on to like the next crazy look. Because I think when I met you, I had like a huge Jufro. Um, I used to have half braids, half afro. I used to shave stuff in the back of my head. And co co they would color in with food coloring so I could have a sunset that was pink with green. I've had, a, I had Morgan Freeman's <laughs> face in the back of my head. I've had the, I've, so, but I always like to keep it like one step ahead. So now that this, the hair erection is popping, um, what, what's, to move forward. what's next? Set what, a new trend. Tell me what to do. Where do I go from here? I don't even... Where do you go from I mean, here? it's got to be something unique, but I just... I don't... You can't just shave it. You've got to keep the length. I know. I, I know. don't know where you, what you do. I'm thinking about going maybe like kind of cheetah print down here, like Dennis Rodman style. <laughs> kind of a Rodman-esque. Rodman. Yeah. Whatever just makes me look like the most ridiculous. Yeah. I love it. Totally.